What is up guys? My name is Nick and welcome back to another COD Warzone video. Today we're going to be going deep into the in-game files to actually figure out which gun is the better option for Warzone. There's a huge debate on the MP7 versus the MP5 and I want to clear everything out for you guys so you actually see a clear image of which gun is actually the one that you want to use within this game. Now we're going to go into the files and yes the game does have this little chart here that shows you which gun is good but I argue that this is only good when you're actually creating a class. This is good to tell you what attack actually make it worse or better and it's not really good for anything else it doesn't tell you the exact damage the guns give it doesn't tell you everything but we're gonna talk about all that within this video and we're gonna figure out finally which one is better now guys before we get into this if you could drop a huge like on this one it took a lot of time to actually figure out all the numbers and figure everything out so if you guys could just appreciate it with a like I would truly appreciate that let me know down in the comments which gun you think is going to win this episode the mp5 or the mp7 now me I, I kind of want the mp7 to win but we're gonna see at the end and subscribe to the channel if you guys are new around here with those notifications turned on now let's get straight into it so these guns are very very different in terms of damage so if you look at the mp5 on this chart right here that somebody has already done and checked out all the numbers for these weapons now if you look at the mp5 it does 34 damage to the chest and stomach while the mp7 only does 25 to each of those zones now we're not going to look at limbs and headshots and all that kind of stuff we're going to keep it simple for the sake of this video and if you look at this it's clear that the mp5 is the winner because it does do nine more damage per shot but that's not the case that isn't the case whatsoever you also got to take into account the the rounds per minute how fast these guns shoot and how fast it takes to kill people and all that kind of stuff because the mp5 shoots at 800 bullets per minute whereas the mp7 shoots at 950 bullets per minute so we're going to go into these numbers and let's look at it in terms of seconds so if we take the mp5 where it shoots 800 rounds per minute and we divide that by six for 60 seconds it comes out to 13.33 shots fired every single second so that's actually a really good number that's pretty good that's not bad whatsoever now if we take those shots fired and multiply it by its damage per shot which is 34 damage per shot we're gonna see a few different things within this so for example 13.33 times 34 damage for each of those 13 shots comes out to 453.20 to damage in one second now that's definitely more than a kill because we all know that the max damage in battle royale is 250 so you could expect to kill somebody in must much less than a second if you guys are actually really close to them and all that kind of stuff now if we look at the mp7 for example which shoots at a much faster rate it shoots at 950 rounds per minute we're going to divide that by 60 seconds as well and this comes out to 15.83 shots per second which is much higher than the mp5 at 13 13.33 now for the sake of comparison we'll imagine that the mp7 only shoots 30 bullets in its magazine even though its minimum magazine size is set to 40 and we're going to take those 15.83 shots per second and multiply it by the damage it does to the chest and it only does 395.75 damage per second which is roughly 60 damage less than the mp5 so it does do less damage than the mp5 but there's a lot more in account here. So we do know that this game does have the armor and it does have the health. The health is set to 100 while the armor is set to 50 per armor plate. So now for the sake of comparison, we're going to imagine that every single person that we go against has full armor, full three plates, which brings their health, their total health to 250 within this game. So the MP7 as it stands will take 0.473 seconds to kill someone up close, which is way less less than a second it's actually less than half a second as well so that's assuming every single bullet hits now if we take the mp5 on the other hand it's going to take significantly less time to kill someone because it does do more damage per second than the mp7 so this one right here will actually take 0.375 seconds uh way less than the mp7 a full millisecond less than the mp7 to actually go ahead and kill someone now if you both start shooting at the exact same time and hit every single shot shots to the chest the mp5 is the clear winner however it's not as simple as that i wish it was as simple as that but it really isn't there's a bunch of other factors at play here so the ads speed for example on both these weapons is exactly the same at 0.166 seconds so 0.16 milliseconds which is really fast 
fast. But the magazine size on both of these weapons is much different. The MP7 at base holds 40, while the MP5 holds 30. Now, the MP5, you could get a maximum of 45 bullets in your magazine by adding an extra magazine attachment. But with the MP7, you could get an additional or an extra, I should say, 20 bullets into your magazine, giving it a total of 60 bullets in one magazine. Now, this is huge in terms of actually killing people in Battle Royale, and this is super important. Because this is a Battle Royale, I'll actually argue that having a bigger magazine size on your class is 10 times better because you're going to be spending a lot less time actually reloading your gun. Now, for the sake of comparison, let's just imagine that both of these weapons had the exact same reload speed, both set at 1.5 seconds, rather than the MP7, which is the actual number is much faster than the MP5, but we're going to try and give it a fair ground here because it's just for the sake of comparison to keep it simple and all that kind of stuff. But I will mention that the MP7 does shoot, or I should say not shoot, it does reload faster than the MP5. So that's actually huge for that weapon. But now we're also going to base the shots at 40 bullets while the MP MP5 has 30, which is the actual numbers on the base magazines. Now each SMG has a reserve of 150 bullets. You guys know that that's as many bullets as you could pick up for any SMG besides the bullets that you already have in your magazine. Now to use all of these bullets, the MP5 actually has to use five different magazines and to use all of them with the MP7, it actually has to use around roughly 3.75 magazines, which is much less than the MP5. So you will basically have to reload five times while using the MP5 while only reloading three times using the MP7. This is a huge factor when it comes to gunfights and if you keep shooting at each other and let's say you're shooting at one guy and he keeps shooting at you you duck to reload and all that kind of stuff which happens a lot in brs you do get into a lot of gunfights where you waste your whole entire magazine without killing someone now the guy for example with the mp5 will have to reload his weapon three seconds longer than the guy with the mp7 if it took 1.5 seconds to reload with with each and every single weapon so this is huge that means that the guy with the mp7 actually could continue shooting at the guy with the mp5 for an additional three seconds and probably end up killing him during that time while the guy with the mp5 is actually wasting his time reloading his weapon so the final thing that i would like to mention also here is that the mp7 has a much easier recoil control than the mp5 does this means that with the MP7, you could take those long shots and barely worry about missing any bullets whatsoever. Whereas if you have the MP5, it has a lot of kick on it. You will be missing a lot of shots. And this does make a huge difference in the game. Now, I'd argue that even though the MP7 does less damage per second, but it does have a bigger magazine, which means in Battle Royale, it's a much better weapon. And the reason for this is because if you have the attachment that gives you 60 mags per uh, magazine, I should say 60 bullets per magazine. Magazine, it, you could literally drop three enemies whereas the guy using the mp5 who has a maximum of 45 per magazine could only kill roughly two guys before needing to reload his weapon the mp7 is definitely the clear winner in that now if you come to a up close gunfight the mp5 if you don't miss any shots will obviously beat the mp7 but it also has more kick when you're getting shot whereas the mp7 is super easy to control when you're getting shot as well so i'm going to say the mp7 is definitely the clear winner within this video even though it does less damage than the mp5 it does stand up a lot better it's better for so many different situations whereas the mp5 is really good for those up close gunfights the mp7 you can literally use it in any type of situation and if you guys want you can check out this mp5 class that i have on screen right here this is the best mp5 class that i could come up with for battle royale and in a second here i'll switch over right to the mp7 and you guys could check out that one as well and here it is on screen this is actually not my class this is made from one of my subscribers infinite ward 19 he actually made this class and i've loved it ever since it's such a good one to use and i have to say i'm definitely going with the mp7 so if you guys want with this one as well if you guys left the comment going with the mp7 as well i truly appreciate that because dude this is it's a good gun it's one of my favorite guns as well now in multiplayer the mp5 is definitely my favorite but in battle royale the mp7 is definitely the clear winner even though it does less damage if you guys want to get those easier shots that's the gun you got to use now like i said at the beginning of this video if you guys could drop a like that would be truly appreciate it I would, I would really really appreciate that a lot guys subscribe to the channel with those notifications turned on we just passed 531,000, so we're on the road to 550 which means we should hit it pretty soon if you guys all do it now i'd also want to say guys literally i didn't think the mp7 would be better but yeah i'm gonna stop talking about it i, 
I love the gun. It's one of my favorite ones. But yeah, that's going to be it. Thank you for watching. My name is Nick, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.